Hello, YouTube. It's Jeremy X here. I'm here with my trusty co-host, Aaron. Say hey. What up, everybody? Here to do my buddy a favor and open some Yu-Gi-Oh! It's been a while. Yeah, we got, for today, we got Duelist Pack Rivals of the Pharaoh. And, uh, let's see, five packs, 36 packs. That means 180 cards so 40, out of a 46-card set. Let's see if we can get them all. Maybe. So what rarities come here? Are there any secret rares, or just is it just ultra rares, commons, and rares up here? Well, I understand that some of them are, some of them may be secret rares, but for the most part, they're just ultra rares and commons. Hey man, wouldn't you kill for a secret rare ultimate though? Oh, absolutely. All right, you open the first pack, buddy. Yeah, let's see what we got here. All, All right, these are first edition. And let's see what we got. I understand why they have to be five cards, though. I mean, because the, the packs themselves are rather cheap overall, which is yeah. nice. Mm -hmm. It's good for a nostalgia play. Stronghold of Moving Fortress. Dedication through Light and Darkness. Spirit Message Eyes. Set those aside. Silent Burning and Castle of Dragon Souls. Set so the silent... Spirit Message aside, because I kind of want to get all those and silent... grab a Dark Sanctuary. Right. And we got Silent Burning as the rare. Now, let's see about you. Silent this. Burning? I've never seen that one, actually. Yeah. Oh! Silent support, much appreciated. Alright, All right. I think I'll take the next pack, huh? Alright. See what we got in here. And we right. got Silent Swordsman, Dark Necrofear, Destiny, Destiny Board, Board F, Silent Magician Level 8. Hello, and... Thousand Eyes! Oh goodness. That's Man, I've got I remember I have one of the limited edition ones of these. It's been a while, and I'm glad he's off the ban list. You know, the because he was never the problem. If anyone remembers the old days of Yu-Gi-Oh, it was Metamorphosis that was the problem. Oh. I remember all three of that combo got banned when all, the only one who really needed to be banned was, you know, Metamorphosis. Yeah. All right, so the rare is Thousand Eyes to Stick. We'll put that with Silent Burning. All right. I'll put the Destiny Board Silent stuff Swordsman together. Level 7. Silent Swordsman Level 3. Another Stronghold. Help a Help Armor. And Castle of Dragon Souls. Again. All right. Hey, you man. The, you get the next one, bud. All right. Let's do this. See if I'm on camera here. Forgive me, everybody. This is my first video opening packs. Well, to be fair, it's mine as well. Oh, really? Small world. We have Silent Swordsman Level 5, Necroface, Spirit Message A, Mystical Beast of Circuit, and a Rare Dragon's Mirror. That's not bad, actually. Ooh, nice. Very Put nice. Put more spirit boards there. Very nice indeed. Still hoping for uh, still hoping for that Dark Sanctuary, though. I've, I've always wanted to make a Bakura deck. Oh. Hey, man, wouldn't it be cool if they made Zork as a card? Well, technically, they made Dark Master Zork. No, no, no. I mean, like... But, yeah, yeah. Zork Necrophades would be good. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Silent Magician Level 8. Another Hell Elbow Emmer. Silent Swords Level 3. Lullaby of Obedience. And, and Dragon, Dragon Shrine. Shrine. You see that lullaby, though. I've never seen that's that. The card, remember, that's the card that caused that Kaiba used to put a Slifer from the bottom of Yugi's deck into his hand during their duel of Battle City. Oh. All right, next pack's ready for All you. All right, that's actually really neat. Kaiba and his thing for Egyptian gods, man. Always finding ways to give them to the opponent. All right, Blast held by a tribute. Green Gadget. Another dedication to light and darkness. A silent Magician level four. And Fiend Sanctuary. Man, I remember the other day I opened my first one of these just a solo because, you know, I needed a, a couple extra dollars to fill the credit limit for, my, for using my cards. And uh, I was like, oh, I wonder if I get something good. And I pulled a Fame Sanctuary, and it was like the highlight of the pack, and it was kind of disappointing. Hmm. All right, let's see what you get. All right. Spirit Message I, another blast held by a tribute. Temple of the Kings, dedication to Light and Artist, and Heck Z. Yeah. YZ Tank Dragon. Nice. Man, I'm so glad they brought that archetype back, man. Oh, yeah. Me too. Me too. Me too. One second. All right. All right. Next pack for you. All uh, right. And there's another Destiny board message, even though it's one we already have. I'm aiming to crack all those in a Dark Sanctuary. That's, that's my goal here. Yeah. All right. So we have another Helpo Emmer. Exchange of the Spirit. That thing is banned for a reason. Ooh, that's... Yellow Gadget, Silver's Cry, This is a two for Blue Silver's Eyes Cry. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon! And a foil Silver's Cry. This is the first foiling of Silver's Cry, isn't it? Uh, I... Yeah, Silver's Cry wasn't foiled in Legend of Blue Eyes. Because it was just a card. That it, was just a, it was just a was just a. That's a good thing to see. I'm, actually, I'm yeah. happy for that. That was a good pack there. That was a really Kaiba pack right there. Yeah. I know it's banned, but Exchange of the Spears is exchange of what now? <laughs> yeah. Fuck! <laughs> Still one of my favorite Green ones. Green Gadget, Dark Necrofear, Spirit Message L, Silent Paladin, 
and another thousand eyes restrict. That was valid, eh? I'll be sure to give this. I'll be sure to give this one to my sister. She she has a boyfriend who's making a Pegasus deck. Oh, uh, isn't he going to be cosplaying as Pegasus? Yep. Awesome. I'll see if I can get a thousand eyes idol for him then. All right, here you go. Uh, that's right. This one's mine. So I gave him a lot of my two monsters. Tunes are really pricey. Oh well, look at this. We got message and we're just missing out. Silent so Swordsman level, level three. three. Mystical Beast of Circuit. Destiny Board F again, and another Dragon Shrine. I'm going to sort the Destiny Boards over here. All right. One more Destiny Board message, and then Dark Sanctuary. I know I'm I know I'm emphasizing that a lot. I'm just really excited for oh, it. Oh, make no mistake. I am too. That was Because one of the... it, it's been a long time coming since that was... Another Temple of the Kings. Blue Eyes Shining Dragon. At Common. Uh, Spirit Message A. Destiny Board. F and Dragon Hello. Master Knight. Holy... And since I now have I have Black Luster Soldier, so that 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 is just oh my goodness. You want to know? A, it's not a really competitive build, but you want to know one of my favorite things? It uses a little bit of heroes, especially Elemental Hero Prisma, and then Beast King of the Swamps to simulate Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon to just kind of cheese out Dragon Master Knight. It's a really it's not as fast as some of the meta builds, but it's potent in a casual environment. It's really oh, fun. I just this blue eyes shining over here because it's I just, common. I just like how four kids use the Master of Dragon Soldier, which is the Japanese name, before they started using it. And again, they did the same thing with the Mech Lords before their names were revealed. Yep. So. All right, next pack. Wow, there's a lot of good... We got some time here. Green Gadgets. Another exchange of spirit. Ah, oh, little three-eyed buddy. He's back. Done. Man, they need to like change him and... Silent Swordsman level five. And Hello, Dark, Dark Magician of Chaos. Man, I remember pulling that when I was a kid. But I didn't know how much it was worth back then because I pulled a foil. Like it was, it was an mm -hmm. ultra rare. Mm -hmm. It was either ultra or super. But I traded it for like a fake set of Exodia because I was a kid and didn't know any better. Yeah, I still have my fake Guildford, but I have special memories of that. So. Yeah, another, another blue, blue eye shining. shining. Temple of the King, Sun Swords, level five, tribute mm -hmm. burial, and dragon's mirror. Man, these are some good looking foils, honestly. You can cannot special them for the rest of the turn. <laughs> Oh, so basically, you get like something. Let's say blue eyes or red eyes, and you don't have tributes on board. You can you can um, banish from graveyard from either graveyard instead of tributes. So that's actually really useful for especially right. for a normal summon based deck like that with pot of duality. Just have a deck that doesn't care about special summoning. You know. Yeah. And by the way, just in case pot of you know pot of avarice, but have you ever tried jar of avarice? Nah, because honestly, if I was using it, all right, let's do this. Silent Swordsman level seven. Red Gadget. Oh, uh, it tricked me. It tricked me. Exchange of the Spirit. And, and Metal, Metal Reflect Slime. slime. Trade your I wonder where they're going to Fiend Sanctuary for the Shiny Obelisk. Don't, I don't do tear between my Fiend Sanctuary. I'm going to trade it. No! Oh! <laughs> the references are strong with us. Oh, very much so. Oh, uh, thanks for inviting me on this anyway, buddy. Oh, it is my absolute pleasure. I don't know if you open another one. This is Let's fun. Necroface, Blue Eyes Shining, Exchange of the Spirit, Red Gadget. And another Blue Eyes Ultimate! Hey, do you still have your one signed by Eric Stewart? Oh, yes. I still I have my original Blue that. Eyes. I would, I, never get rid of, I would never get rid of that Right? One. I remember the mo you you were not doing so well in a couple duels. Then the moment after he signed it, because what he did is he signed it, and then to dry the ink, he breathed on it. He blew his breath on it. Th then this guy, this guy here, turns around and beats me with it. If that's not, like, a sign, I don't know what is. I was like, it was one of my rare duels when I was completely helpless. I just hope I don't end up less a dick like Kaiba. Nah, man, you got a good heart. All right, Necroface, Silent Magician, Red Gadget, Dark Necrofear, and an ec another Tank Cannon. Tank Dragon. I see Tank Same Cannon. difference, man. All right. I'm so glad. Dude, this has got a lot of this. What I'm really happy about this is a lot of these were so hard to come by. Like, they were like tens into twenties of dollars, if not more. And now they're just like... Spirit Message L! Hello! Spirit Message I, Sangun, Hello Stronghold, Disney Board. and Metal Reflect Slime. Yep. Now we just need Dark now Sanctuary. We got, now, we got, now we got Destiny Board. Oh, man. Maybe we can get a three set. Because, I mean, went... look, we need two more L's, another A, and another N, and we've got a three set of that. And then Dark Sanctuary. I really want to make a deck around that, man. It went through several changes. Now it all says final. What did it say before? Disney! Disney. Oh, man. I, I kind of wish they'd errata Sangon and bring him back, because he was one of my favorite cards. All right. Stronghold of Moving Fortress. Silent Swordsman level 3. Dark Necrofear. Destiny Board. And another Dragon Master Knight. Ah, uh, man. Just Destiny pulling Board. rares out the wazoo here, are I we? Mean, 
Yeah, I know. A lot of them very iconic. What I'm really happy is I might actually trade you for this Silver Scry. Because I mean, I run. I mean, I run it in my uh, in my special little. You know, you know my deck, my uh, my higher attic rod. Oh deck yeah, your higher attic rod. Deck. But I don't know since I'm doing it more traditional. I think I'm just replacing all those with monster reborns anyway. Oh hey, look at that. Let's hey look. Let's show them. Spirit message, message L. Mystical Beast of Sir Cat, Silent Swordsman level seven, Blast by Tribute, and Dragon Shrine. Let me put that in the spirit message thing. All right. We're gonna organize this in a minute. We're just too happy right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you can you? I mean, can you blame us? This is our first ever booster box. This is just pure nostalgia right here, and some of it's not even nostalgic because like stuff like let me point it out. These two, I remember waiting on the deck when these were announced. Man, I remember. I remember when I built that and I helped you build one. Yeah, I first oh, saw man. it when I saw when I saw Darren Dunstan and Eric Stewart. Man, I love the voice actor duels. I don't care if they're staged, they're they're always a delight. Like Pegasus versus Merrick is still by far my favorite. That card isn't supposed to be released to the general public until September. I'm not a member of the general public. I'm the president of Kaiba Corp. Made a couple calls, got the cards delivered to my doorstep the next day. Anyway. Speaking of cards, we got Yellow, Yellow Gadget, Gadget, Silent Magician Level 8. Silent Swordsman level 5, Silent Swordsman! Just pure Silent Swordsman? And, and Dark Magician of Chaos! Dude. Yeah, that's a pretty sweet card they got going This guy there. can just splash with any warrior. Okay. And they did one for Silent Magician too. Good, because I remember using those. Those guys, were, I, I pulled foils of those. I'm like, I love those. It pretty much works like Silent Swordsman and Silent Magician do in the, in, in the anime and manga. Oh, going okay. up in power with every turn. Help him, Air. Now the Silent Magician level 8. Dark Necro Fear, Magnet, Magnet Force, and, and another, another Thousand Eyes Restrict. Eyes restrict. Awesome. Stop doing that, that's creepy. <laughs> Alright, Magnet Force. This turn all monsters on the field whose original types are machine or rock or unaffected by your, oh, your opponent's monster effects. Okay, because weren't they going to release, didn't they release a um a new uh, Magnet, aren't they releasing a new Magnet Warrior deck in Japan? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, because I know, oh yeah, they are, because one's going to be the Magnet Warriors and one's going to be... Uh, new versions of these guys. I remember hearing about that. Oh yeah, that that's a uh, magnet. What I'm really happy about is how they're actually going back to old archetypes, like how they're making blue eyes, dark magician, and a red eyes a thing again. Cause like they were awesome, and just their childhood memories, and now they're actually viable in a tournament stand. Oh yeah, that's right. The uh, the new Yugi and Kaiba structure decks yeah. are coming out. Let's see, Silent Swordsman level seven. Necroface, Green Gadget, Spirit Message, N, and another Thousand Eyes Restrict. Well, we only need uh, one more of L and A to have a three set of each. That's not. This is not a bad bounty. All right, this is my pull. All right. Let's see what we got here. Hey, yo, Jeremy, move your hands. <laughs> Silent Magician level eight, Blast held by a Tribute, Green Gadget, Dedication through Light and Darkness, and another Castle of Dragon Souls. Right. You know, I was kind of thinking of rebuilding the old structure decks for, um, you know, the, the Azure Eyes mm -hmm. deck, and just adding the rare versions of them just because I can. Because now they actually have rare printings. Ah, Electromagnet Warrior. Yeah. It's like the new versions, so. Yeah. Alright, you're pulled. Right. Actually, I'm going to let you do this, because right now we've got, let's see here. I mean, it should have been even. Twelve packs left. Man, we're into the nitty gritty. Mm-hmm. Let's see just a can... question. Dark Sanctuary did get released in the English one, right? They're not yes, pulling the in here? All right. No. That just would be a really it's rare just a one. Really, it's just a really we've rare We've pulled one. a lot. All right. Hello. According to this, it's a... Is it a sacred rare? It's a sacred It's an rare. ultra rare. Oh, oh. Because we've been pulling regular rares and some ultras, too. There are no secret rares in this. Oh, good, because, you know, they put... I think they made up for the secret rares in literally every other set before this. Like, I remember when secret rares were special. Anyway, Necroface... Spirit Message A, Mystical Beast of Circuit, Help OMR, and another Dragon's Mirror. Hey man, all we need is one more L. Alright. Let's see, we got 12 packs left. I'll start with this one, and you can start with the other one. Alright, man. Don't let it be up too long, either. Here we go. I swear, half of the euphoria of these packs is just Blue boring. Eyes Shining, Spirit Message A, Destiny Board, Green Gadget, Dragon Master Knight. Hello, three set. Here you go. Ah, more spirit boards that we don't have. Come on, another L and some dark sanctuaries, man. Yeah, come on, at least. At Give least us one. Two. Give us one. Oh, shoot. Well, all right, so. <laughs> Mystical Beast of Circuit. Another Destiny Board F. That makes six. Holy crap. Spirit Message I. 
Silent Magician level 4, and another Blue Eyes Ultimate. Man, I remember when Blue Eyes Ultimate was so hard to get. Yeah, back when it was just a jump promo. Dude, that was the worst thing. Like, you could at least give it in Legend of... Well, to be fair, he didn't have it during the Legend of Blue Eyes times, if I remember right. Yeah. Let's see what you got. Silent Magician level 4, Blue Eyes Shining, Temple of the Kings, Sp Silent Swordsman level 5, and another Blue Eyes Ultimate. Let me, let me just go ahead and count how many Ultimates we have over here. We have like four now. Wait, where'd it go? Yeah, we have like four Ultimates, man. Do you know how much money we would have made off of these as a kid if we had four Blue Eyes Ultimates? Uh, like... A lot. <laughs> Go ahead and say that now. Yeah. All right. Who's back? Your pack. All right. Exchange of the spirit and yellow gadget. Spirit message in. Silence of level three and another dragon master knight. All right. They need to make that easier to summon because it's so worth it. We are down to our last eight packs. Big money, no whammies. Eight. We are now in our last quarter. Let's see, Silent Magician level 4, Silent Swordsman level 5, Yellow Gadget, Blast by Tribute, Metal Reflect Slime. Alright. Spanking the pack for luck. Uh, not sure how much of the good that's gonna do, but. Oh, dude. Who knows. I'm also a Magic player, and doing that has gotten me some really rare cards. It's, it's a superstitious thing. It, it, it by no means guarantees what you're gonna get, but it's, all, it, it's a feel good kind of thing, you know? Yeah. Stronghold and Moving Fortress. Kind of like pressing down B when you're trying to catch a Pokemon. Yeah, that actually has no influence on whether you catch the Pokemon or not. But we did it anyway. Yeah. Yellow Gadget, Necroface, Silent Swordsman over 3, and YZ Tank Dragon. Are there any other XYZ cards in there, or is it just YZ Tank Dragon? Check mm. the list. No, it's just YZ Tank Dragon. Oh, that's unfortunate. Strange. I suppose since XYZ Dragon Cannon themselves has already had like a million reprints, and to be honest, that one's kind of unloved. I hope the new one does a little better, because back in back when it was like standard issue, I wouldn't say standard issue, but more current, just blowing up a monster was a valuable effect. Science Science Level 7, Red Gadget, Spirit Message, Spoon. and Neutron Blast, and Heck Dragon yeah! Master Knight. Hello, Blue Eyes Ultimate Attack. All right. Let's I find it funny that we. It would have been even better if we pulled a Blue Eyes Ultimate and a Neutron Blast in the same pack. Well, <sighs> technically, Dragon Master Knight requires Blue Eyes Ultimate for yeah, summoning yeah. material. Okay. All right, let's track this. Mystical Beast of Circuit, Destiny Board F, Necroface, another Foil Silver Scry, and Castle of Dragon Souls. Put that Our there. last four packs. It's getting down to it. I don't. I. I hope we pull at least one. Just one. That's all I'm asking. Watch it be the last pack. Oh, we... Destiny board. Red gadget. Spirit message A. Sun gun. Dark magician of chaos. Ugh. Ugh. Hope I'm not jinxing it over here. Are these are the last three? Yep. Ooh, buddy. Show me something good. Red gadget. Helpo Emmer. Sun gun. Another Silent Paladin? Fiend Sanctuary. Ah, tricked me. Hey, another Silent well, Paladin. My last pack. And then... And then your last pack. I guess we gotta wrap it up from there. Then we should, like, probably take a break and tally our total bulls, maybe. Yeah. Exchange of the Spirit. Yellow Gadget. Silent Magician Level 8. Magnet Force. Fiend Sanctuary. Ugh. We got more luck than me, bud. Here we go. Silent Magician level 4, Red Gadget, Dark Necrofear, Stronghold, and Metal Reflect Slime. Unfortunately, no, no Dark me. Sanctuary today. Yeah. However, let's just go ahead and tally exactly how many of the other messages we got. 8, Destiny Board. 4, Spirit Message I. Five, Spirit Message N. Also five, Spirit Message A. And only two, Spirit Message L. All right. Uh, first. All right, shall we start categorizing? Or shall we leave that for after the video? All right, let's... All right, we're going to take a break and we'll tally our results. 
and do a quick pan over. Well, so here's our hall. We didn't get a fiend sanctuary. Well, or... Yeah, we got fiend sanctuary. We didn't get dark sanctuary. We didn't get dark sanctuary. We did not get silent magician or silent sword slash. But let's or... just focus on what we do have, huh? Or Magna Reverse or Dark Sanctuary, which are oh, the well. only four cards out of this entire 46 card set we did not obtain. Really? Those are the only yeah. ones we didn't get? Silent Swordsman, Silent, Silent Magician, Silent Sword Slash, Magnet. Magna Reverse, and that would have been Dark Sanctuary. But, ah. all in all... We got pretty... everything else, though. And let me and guess, multiple... the others were Ultras and Super Rares, right? Uh, yeah, pretty much. Alright, so and, and out of this, we did give away... We did give away one blue eye shining to a friend of ours. We in total pulled five. So, just one to keep, if anyone's confused on the tally there. Yeah, let's see. Let's see, we got one silent swordsman, two silent paladins, one silent burning, two magic force, one neutron Magnet blast, force. one lullaby of obedience, one tribute burial, five dragon master knights. Man, they used to be worth so much. But it's good to see them reprinted for, like, you know, the general public. Three Dark Magicians of Chaos, four dedications through Light and Darkness. By the way, buddy, if you ever do make a Dark Magician deck, did you know that this is actually not part, because of its Japanese name, it is not part of the Dark Magician archetype? True. true However, true. this is that is why this card was made in the first place, so you can splash it with Dark Magician. Oh, yeah. Three, three Fiends Sanctuary, seven Silent Swordsman level three. Please tell me we only have three Silent Swords from level 7. That would have been hilarious. We have six Silent Swords from level 5s. And I believe five... Yes, five. Five Silent Swords from level 7. We also have... Let's see. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Five Silent Swords from level 4. Six. Six Silent Swords from level 4. Silent Magician level 4. And how many Silent Magician level 8s do we have? Six. Right. Two, three sets of green. each. Let's see. Green Gadget, we have six. Red Gadget. Hey, Avery, looking at this gadget, you know what it reminds me? You know what time it reminds me of? The what? time of Ultimate Offering, when that wasn't banned. Oh, goodness. That thing, that made gadgets actually a little scary. Six of each gadget and six of the Moving Fortress. Let me just go ahead and check that. Yep. For ultimates, technically four, we had five. But we pulled we five shinings, but we gave one away. Three YZ tank dragons. Three dragons mirror. Three dragons shrine. Uh, three. I thought we got more. No, two three. Sil two silvers yeah. cry. Four castle of dragon souls. And six help oemers. So much merit. Four metal reflect slimes. Five blasts held by a tribute. Six exchanges of the spirit. Six mythical beasts of circuits. Ironically, four temple of the kings. <laughs> uh, it's so good to see him back, even though he's still banned. Four sand guns. But nowadays, not even thinking about banned cards anymore. Seven necro faces. I believe almost the same amount of Necrofears. Six Dark Necrofears. Close. And I believe six or seven. No, eight. Yeah, we got eight Destiny, eight board. Destiny boards. Four Spirit Message I. Five Spirit, Five Spirit Message N. Five Spirit Message N. A and only three and three spirit, spirit message, message L's. So along we with three oh four thousand eyes restricts. restricts. Man, it's so good to see him off the ban list because uh if anyone remembers back in the day, the only problem was there was a combo called Go Control. You use scapegoat, metamorphosis, and thousand eyes restrict. You would get the tokens. And since you weren't tributing it for a tribute summon, you were using it as fodder for metamorphosis. You just got a 3,000 ice restrict and locked the game back when there was no toolkit to mess with it. So oh. basically it would lock the game and there was nothing anyone could do about it. Oh yeah, those are the old uh, days. Over time, they, got, they took scapegoat off the list like it was at one for a bit. 1,000 ice restrict, 
just recently came off the list, but the one I am betting you they are keeping on that list is Metamorphosis, lest we see the return of Goat Control. Oh, absolutely. So yeah, Jeremy and I were actually discussing, we, uh, I really enjoyed my time here with you guys, and uh, it was really fun, and I was actually thinking, because, you know, I'm not a tournament player anymore, I'm in the game for fun now, because I left for a little bit. I never even went. Hey, uh, you didn't miss anything, trust me. <laughs> so we were thinking, maybe have a little corner every now and again that just talks about fun ways to use a lot of these cards, like, in just little efficient, yet, you know, non-competitive decks. You know, a deck that works that isn't complete, you know, an utter terribleness, but at the same time, it could even... We're probably thinking of a segment of make, putting it in advanced format, one version of it in traditional format, and one in unlimited. Because I'm working on a project of mine that needs a little discard outlet uh, to get rid of a couple cards to get in Graveyard, and since I'm, you know, not caring about the ban list anymore, I'm using Graceful Charity in that. And so who, who cares about the ban list anymore? Uh, it depends on if you're on even ground. I'm very I am very uh, even when it comes to this game. Like, hey, if you can use this many ban cards, I can use this many ban cards. If you're not using any ban cards, I won't use any ban cards because they are banned for they were banned for a reason. And even and for a while, even though I wasn't playing, you know, in tournament style, I still went by advanced because it felt fair. Oh you know? yes. But at the same time, a lot of the good cards that are banned. Are very, are very iconic in the show, and you know what's what was this ca what was this game made for? If not to you know live a little bit of the moment, they wouldn't have made this set if they didn't want you to have some of the same moments the show did. Exactly, and like a lot of it's just fun to find which ones you really resonate with and just build a deck around it. Like the silence, the silence. I'm so glad these guys got an archetype to themselves, and they got support cards. Like these guys were like. Honestly, this could be a really fun deck to make, and I would love to work with Jeremy here and think of a list for you guys, in case you wanted to play it. Alright, so I guess this could be Jeremy and Aaron's Yu-Gi-Oh! Corner coming soon, right alongside in Return to the Past Gaming. Yeah, the name Aaron is pending. <laughs> yeah, but we'll see, where, we'll see where we go from there, and hopefully we'll upload more content for you soon. So for now, this is Jeremy X and temporarily Aaron, signing off.